So welcome back to another edition of Fireside Brew Review. So it's the first week of January. I got a nice blazing fire going here. Real nice. Today we're going to talk about the Apple Jacked Ale from GL Heritage Brewery. We're also going to talk about the Apple Jacked Ale Reserve from GL Heritage Brewery. And what makes it possible too is the Apple Caramel Whiskey from Wolfhead Distillery. So, I'm going to kind of try all three. We're going to cook up a nice pork chop with bacon and apple on a nice January day. Let's get started. So we're going to start off by getting some of this bacon, put it in the pan. So got a nice little cozy here, put the beer in there, especially in the month of January. It's nice to hold on to this instead of a cold can. Starting to get that bacon cooked down a little bit, so put our pork chop here in the pan. Let that sit in the bacon grease there a little bit. An apple here that I'll dice up and throw that in with the bacon. Okay, I got all that apple sliced up. Let's throw that in the pan. So I've got a really nice heat coming up of here. So crack this open. Put some of this inside. So while we wait for this to cook up, let's try some of this. So this is the Apple Jacked Ale from GL Heritage. It says it's a smooth ale infused with gently spiced fresh pressed apples and a blend of premium apple caramel whiskey from our neighbors at Wolfhead Distillery. Enjoy. I think we will. Okay. Right away it hits you, you get those apple notes in the beer. Wow, real easy drinking beer. Little bit of apple flavor, little bit of sweetness from the apples. Boy, that's good stuff. Still getting out here in the backyard. Not bad here by the fire. Get a nice little cook going on. And uh, enjoy a nice beverage.
So let's taste some of this delicious pork chop. Looks like it's just cooked perfect. <laughs> Try some of this apple and bacon. Mmm. Enjoying it. Perfect pairing with this apple jacked ale. Hello? Hi. I'm just filming here. So it's my lovely wife on the phone. And yes, pick up some milk and some bread. And, um, you know, we'll see you when you get home. And uh, no, we're okay with butter and sugar. No, you're enough sugar for me. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh. Wrong number. <laughs> wow, this is delicious. Now we're going to do the Sophie scale. So if you don't know what the Sophie scale is, watch this. Take a drink and then you think, pick a color, any color. That's the Sophie scale. Okay, got that? Okay, here we go. Ever, you know what? I think we have a winner right here. It's called Yellow Green. That's what it reminds me of right here. In addition to our Apple Jacked Ale from GL Heritage, we have the Apple Jacked Ale Reserve. And it's like 11% alcohol. So we got to try some of this. So you can see it's a nice amber color. It's got some carbonation in there. Try some of this. Wow. Right away the sweetness from the apple just hits you. That apple flavor and the sweetness. Wow, what a smooth drink. Mm. Boy, they put all that flavor, a little bit stronger, much sweeter. Boy, what a nice, uh, nice drink. Not quite a wine, not quite a beer. Wow, what a depth of flavor in that. So to finish off here, we got Wolfhead Apple Caramel Whiskey. Some of this. Now we'll try some of this whiskey. Wow. Wow, the potentness of that whiskey just hits you and it's got that apple afternoon. It's good stuff. I'm gonna continue on eating here. I'm gonna enjoy some more of this ale, some more of the reserve. And of course, finish off with some of this whiskey. But as you can see, in January, I'm still in the backyard. So I encourage you to get out there, find your place in the back, enjoy yourself, and we'll see you next time on the next brew review.